Welcome back YouTube family. If this is your first time here, my name is Kieran Davis and this video is gonna be about the INTP personality, my personality type. Stay tuned. Okay, so the INTP personality type comes from the MBTI personality test, which is the most popular test in the world, if I'm not mistaken, but definitely America. 80% of large companies use this personality test to indicate if a staff will properly fit in the staff that they already have. The INTP is said to be the rarest, well, probably not. I think the second rarest personality that there is, um, it is amongst 3.5% of the population. So that means that majority of people think that we are strange and peculiar, weird. That doesn't mean that they don't like us. It's just that it's a known thing that we are. Usually the opinion that is different from everybody in the room usually has a completely different outlook. We're just that person in the, in the room. The INTP is probably the biggest amongst all the introverts, or probably the most introverted personality that there is. See, we have a real thirst for knowledge, so it seems like, oh, how can you be alone? We're not really bored when we're alone. We actually get fueled from our own thoughts and, you know, and, you know, taking our own selves into perspective. That's really what we like, honestly. Um, but ultimately, somewhere down the line, we really want to gain knowledge so we can help the world. It's just that, will we ever get out of our, you know, our isolation? Will we ever get out of this whole state of just being so comfortable being alone so that we can go off and help the world with this knowledge that we've been acquiring since we were kids. The INTP really does not like working jobs where they don't feel valued. We don't wanna do a job that we feel like anybody's qualified to do. We don't wanna do a job that no one appreciates. We wanna go into the workplace, feel like we are like very pivotal to the success of the company. We don't wanna just work any kind of job. And usually if an INTP has to work, you know, some dead end like fast food or whatever, like I currently work in retail. I don't like it, but I feel like I do add value to the place, even though the, the job itself does not make me feel valuable. So all in all, I don't wanna stay there for a long time. Ergo, I feel like it's best for INTPs to find something that, that take their knowledge and attach that to some form of, of purpose and passion and start a business off of that, which ultimately what I'm trying to do with coaching, with YouTubing and things of that nature. So to all of my INTPs watching, please niche down your knowledge. Give up all the random knowledge that we've been learning. Give it up and, and hyper niche. Focus on something that you can really, that you feel like this is what you really love and this is what you can offer the world on terms of helping people become better. Focus down, use your knowledge, help people, share yourself with the world. I know in the beginning I said that we are like known to be weird or strange, but the thing is that people love the INTP. People love us so much, it's hard to not like us because we're so honest and different and people love that about us. We usually have a very unique perspective. We usually have a very high IQ when it comes to just reading the room and people that surround us and knowing people's intentions and seeing how things will work and play out. We're almost psychic in a way. But with that, what I want to tell you guys is that people love us and you are ready for the world. I know a lot of INTPs, we always feel like we're prepping for our launch. It's all, we're almost like the kid that never moves out of the house. We're always preparing for a launch. It's like we're afraid of the world and we're trying to make sure that we are fully ready and prepared for what the world may throw at us. And I'm telling you that you are more prepared than any other personality because you live off of that. So don't be afraid to share yourself with the world. Just go out here and start connecting and start shedding and create a new comfort zone for you. Like I said, I work in retail and it's hard for me to talk to people, be around a lot of people. I have to drink Red Bulls and candy bars just to kind of give myself a little pick me up just so I can interact with them. But at the end of the day, I'm drained. When I come home, it's like, oh my God. And then I'm like, you know, I have the energy to come back. Like that's why they're making YouTube, like, you know, something like this, like you can do a YouTube channel. Like I'm talking to people and I feel like I'm talking to people, but it doesn't have the pressure or it doesn't have, I'm not in a large group, I'm not out and it's just not, it doesn't feel the same, but I really feel like I'm able to connect this way and I can do it in my own way and help people try to give value also. INTPs, you are ready for the world. The whole idea of it is, the world is not ready for us. There's people who are intimidated by our intellect, who are intimidated by how we are in our intuition and how we see things and how we see people and how quick we're and how quick witted we are and how we are able to analyze and break things down. So we have to understand that the world is more afraid of us than we are of it. And if you keep on allowing yourself to, to step back and, and play the background and, and or not exist at all, 
you're you're kind of stepping away from your purpose. I feel like we're all here for a reason. And if you don't live and express that reason, then the world will never get to, you know, experience and have the impact of you, who you are today and the reason why you exist. So please share yourself with the world. We need what you have in your head and share that with everybody else. And I hope that what I'm doing is giving people value. And I hope that what I'm doing is motivating and inspiring people to realize their potential and become their greatest self. I did not want to make this video too long. I made an INTP video about two years ago, just randomly once I kind of found out about it. And I ended up actually taking, when I took my psychology class in college, um, they made us take the personality test. And I'm like, dude, I already know about this. Like, you know, so, I mean, which happens a lot in college. I kind of knew a lot of the stuff they were teaching me anyway. But guys, I thank you guys for sticking around this long. If you made it this long, please hit a thumbs up for me. Hit that subscribe button and join my YouTube family. Drop a comment below. I will put in the video a link in the descriptions of the personality test so you can figure out what you are. INTP is what I am, so it's best for me to speak on my own experiences as an INTP and give advice for other INTPs. But I'm pretty sure you have an amazing personality too. So check that out. It's all about self-awareness. So learning your personality type, something that big companies and corporations and colleges are teaching their students and workers and stuff like that. I'm pretty sure knowing this will benefit a lot and help you more be more self-aware. Even take the, you know, take your uh, your girlfriends or your boyfriends or whatever, uh, their personality type and see how well you guys mix and learn up about it, man. It's interesting, at least for me, but that's, you know, I, I like nerdy stuff like that, man. I like learning about myself and the people around me. So it's psychology, I love it. So yeah, again, thank you guys for watching. Stay blessed, stay positive. Until next time.